The Economic Community of West African States has refuted claims of manipulation of external powers uh, in its efforts to resolve the political instability in the Niger Republic. Commissioner for Political Affairs, Peace and Security, Abdel Fattah uh, Musa, disclosed this while reacting to rumors in some quarters. The West African bloc is working to restore political stability in Niger after the military toppled and detained President Mohamed Bazoum on July 26th. ECOWAS met the West African military defense chiefs in Accra, Ghana, last Thursday to discuss a possible armed intervention to reverse a coup, with many accusing the bloc of being pushed by foreign powers. Mr. Musa says foreign support is not part of the consideration of the West African body. He noted that ECOWAS has not given any consideration to the difficulties of the nationals as well as multinationals who have given a foot on the ground. It's funny because they have always thought that we the people are stupid, that we are fools and they can talk with us as they want. They have always thought it that way. But to their surprise, we the people have beat their imagination. We are, we are more than what they think we, we are. They, they might thought that we are stupid and that we do not have any sense of reasoning. But they will be shocked to see that we know exactly what is going on. We can clearly see what's going on. And we are all watching what they are doing. The fact that ECOWAS had to come out to clarify, to say that they are not in bed with the West, that they are not puppet of the West, just see how little they are, how insecure they feel, and how shameful they have become. Yeah, they have, they have become. They are not in bed with the West. They are not puppet of the West. They are doing just what is just and fair. To whom? The people or your friend, uh, Mohamed Basum? Who are you really looking after? Is it the people or is it your, 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 your friend, your, your colleague, the, the post leader of, of, of Niger? You see? The people do not matter. The common Nigerians do not matter. No one is even worrying if those people have eaten. ECOWAS is not even concerned if their sanctions is hurting the ordinary Nigerians. They are not even concerned about that. They are not even worrying if the sanction is hurting small businesses in the country and if the closure of borders is hurting the people or not. They are not even worried about that. All they are saying is we have to reinstate the deposed leader of the country. That's all what they talk about. What about the people? Don't they matter? No one is concerned about them. No one is worried about them. Isn't the people supposed to be the first priority of ECOWAS? Having ECOWAS realize that the people of Niger matter a lot? Haven't they? Now they come out to tell us that what we are saying is all false and uh, we might have been misled into thinking that ECOWAS is a puppet of the West. Are you kidding me? <laughs> it's all out there for everyone to see. Okay? Your actions and words within the past few weeks have only discredited you. Have only led to many people to lose credibility in you and have only let everyone understand where your loyalty lies. Most people might have thought that ECOWAS was there to look out for the African people, to look out for the common people, to look out for those helpless people. But what ECOWAS have said and have been doing for the past few weeks 
have opened the eyes of many Africans and now they can see clearly. Everyone understands that ECOWAS is not looking out for the common people. It's not doing what they are supposed to be doing. It's not. That all what they care about is making sure that they get support from the West. They get a, a, a hand of applause from the West. And they become body body with Westerners like Emmanuel Macron. That's all what they are thinking about. Let Africans be damned. Let the people go to hell. We don't care. All we care is the West. All we care is making sure that we depose the military junta and we reinstate our person, our friend, Mohamed Mbazo. That's all what they care about. So let me just say this to ECOWAS in case any of their members came across this video. What you've done in the past few weeks have made all of us, the Africans, lose confidence, lose respect, lose credibility in you. ECOWAS is nothing short of a Western puppet. End of it. And ECOWAS is not looking out for the people of Niger who are the ones suffering the most because of what ECOWAS has done. We have to say this. And anyone who is a Pan-Africanist or anyone who has been following what has been going on in Africa we see that ECOWAS isn't really catering to the needs of Africa or Africans. They are not. And it's high time we call them out on this. So I'm grateful to all those fellow Pan-Africanists who have been calling out ECOWAS for all this thing they have been doing. Keep it up. Increase the pressure. ECOWAS must understand that the African people come first. But you guys out there, what do you think might be the reason why ECOWAS had to come out to defend themselves to let us know that they are not a puppet of the West and whatever they are doing is for the benefit of the local Nigerians. What might be their reason? Share your thoughts and opinions with us in the comment section below because like always, we love hearing what you have to say. And also, do not forget to like this video, share this video, follow our Facebook page, and most importantly, subscribe to this channel because little did of good we, like the one you're doing just now, help us a lot I wish I ever be grateful to you. So thank you very much for doing just that. And like always, see you in the next one.